Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can connect to a file server in Files app on the iPhone 14 series. Now, a file server can be a share folder on a Windows computer or on your Mac computer. It can be a files, uh, actual file server or a NAS drive, a network attached storage drive. Or it could be a remote folder that you can connect via a URL, a web address. So uh, the first thing that you need to do is go to your file server and make sure it is shared. It is, uh, it can be publicly uh, accessed uh, via your uh, local uh, storage or a local network or via a public network. Okay, now first on my uh, Windows computer, what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a new folder. And here I'm going to call IT Jungles uh, Share. Okay, and then I'm going to press on Enter. Then on this folder here, I'm going to right click and click on Properties. In Properties, I'm going to click on Sharing and then click on Share. And then I'm going to add in a user. So we need to add in a user my admin and then I'm going to click on add now this user uh, I have already previously created um, in on the computer I'm going to assign it read and write permission so if you do not have a username on your computer you can create one so if you don't know how to um, create a new user on your computer just uh, go and find out how you can create a new user uh, so that you can use it um, to uh, allow your iPhone to connect to this uh, computer. Now, um, all the instruction will be different depending on if you're using a Windows computer, a Linux computer, or a Mac computer. Uh, the instruction will be different uh, uh, based on each different type of um, a share folder that we are creating right now. Now I'm going to tap on the share button. And then tap on done. And I'm going to click on advanced sharing and then I'm going to click on share this folder and I'm going to click on permission and I'm going to give it full permission for this folder and then I'll click on add and I'm going to put in I admin and then click on OK and I'll give it full permission and then click on apply, click on OK and then click on OK again. So now it has a share folder so if I click on it properties it should now be a share folder so you can see here it has this path network path Windows David ID Jungles shared all right so once you have set up a share folder on the Windows computer we can now turn our attention back to the iPhone now on the iPhone here I'm going to tap on um, files so from the home screen open up the files app or you can open up the files app from the app the library and then tap on the browse button at the bottom next tap on the more button at the top here from the pop-up tap on connect to server all right you need to put in the server address so if you have a remote server you need to put in the url address if your server is part of a local network uh, such as your Wi-Fi. So if you your computer is connecting to the same Wi-Fi router as the iPhone, it is now a local network. So you want to put in the server address and you're probably wondering what is my server address. Okay, so for example, on my computer here, I'm going to open up the DOS command prompt. You can do this by pressing on the Windows plus the R command and then type in CID. So in here we can uh, put in uh, CMD, CMD, and then that will open up a new DOS command. Okay, so now we are in a, com a prompt command. We're going to put in, um, you can put in hostname to find out the name of your computer. So the hostname is Windows David. You can put that into um, the server name right here if it is if your network is configured uh, with the right uh, DNS name sometimes using the host name will not work so you can use the IP address instead so here I'm going to put in IP config to find out the actual 
um, IP address of this computer. So on this computer here, the IP address is this one right here, IP version 4. So you can see the IP address is 192.168.1.112. So that is the address I'm going to put into the iPhone. Okay, so on the iPhone here, previously I have uh, connected to this server. So it's showing me the history. I can just remove that. And in here I can put in 192.168. Dot one dot one one two. Okay, so that would be the server address, and then tap on connect. Next, it, you can connect as guest or register user. So depending on the folder that we set up on a Windows computer, whether it is uh, public or it needs a username and password. In my case, I have assigned a username. As you remember, the username is my admin. So we put in the username and password. So password is admin in for my username. When you set up a username on the Windows computer, you are required to, to create a password. And that is the password that we're going to use to put in here. After that, tap on the next button. And now you can see it connected to that Windows server. And here it shows a few, uh, a few folders because previously I have uh, set up a few share folder on my Windows computer. One of the folder here is IT Jungle's share, which we created before. So if I tap on this folder, at the moment, there is nothing in this folder. Okay, now if I go back to my computer, you can see on my iPhone, it is now empty. And if I close this prompt, and this is the folder right here, IT Jungle's share. At the moment, it has nothing in this uh, folder. And in this folder here, I have uh, some photos on it. So what I'll do is I'm going to copy a few pictures over. So I'm going to click on copy and I'll paste it in here. And you can see on my phone immediately, it shows three photos. So I can tap on that. And it shows the photos in here straight away. So I'll tap on done to close that. So that is how you can access uh, files uh, how you can connect to a file server and then access files uh, directly on my computer. Now on the iPhone here, can I can also create a folder. So if I tap on the more button and then tap on new folder and then give it a name, test. You can see on my computer, it also create a new folder called test right here. And I can move files into that folder so I can uh, select files and I can move into the test folder. Now I need to go back right here and then go into my share and then go into ID Jungle's uh, share and then test and then tap and move. And you can see on my computers, it moved into that test folder. Once you are connected to the file server, you can manage files on your iPhone. And here on your iPhone, you can also access files on your iPhone and you can also copy to the computer. So I can select uh, a number of photos and videos and I can uh, move to my file server. So I can go down to my network folder and then I can move to the test folder and then tap on copy or move. You can copy or move. And that's it. Now on the computer, you can see files are being populated or being copied over. It may take some time depending on how much files you have, but we can uh, move them over. So here I can go into uh, IT Jungles and go into my archive. Here you can see I can select a number of photos and then tap on uh, move. So I can move here, so I'll go back and then go down and tap on the share folder, test. It's a bit slow at the moment because I think it's still transferring files to the server or to the file server. And in here I can tap on copy. And you can see now it is copying over to my network drive or network folders. And there it is, I can open it on my computer. And you can see this picture right here. 
on my phone. It is on the computer right here. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.